Good evening, good evening, everyone. 谢谢老师，我要开始吗？还是咪咪姐他们会说一下？咪主持人直接啊，可以开始了。OK， 好。Hello, hi, yeah, good evening, everyone. Um, my name is Rebecca Chu. You can, you guys could can call me Becca. First of all, welcome to our Monday training, um, English training program every Monday. Um. Let me just introduce myself a little bit. So,、um, I joined New Skin to a little over two years ago.、Uh, my background is、um, accounting and master master degrees in accounting, and I, you know, joined the one of the big four accounting firm、um, after I graduated, and then I just,、uh, you know, switched to private practice. Worked in a couple of、uh, different financial industry. Um, as an internal audit or compliance, so I joined New Skin.、Um, I actually I'm all in now, you know, with New Skin.、Um, I didn't quit my job because New Skin, but it, New Skin did accelerate my departure from my careers from financial industries because、um, I was actually attracted by our team and to U.S. legacy. I was, you know, once I learned about New Skin, the Culture, the you know innovation, and the science behind the products, and you know our force for good, everything pretty much. You know,、um, I was really really amazed, and、um, I love people around our team. I love their energy, so I really really enjoyed. Decided to you know go in、uh, all in、um, in the middle of、um, 2020.、Um, anyway, so today. Um, uh, we have a special, our special、uh, guest,、uh, Pei Yi Li, who's a、um, currently di a Blue Diamond director, Nourish the Children ambassador.、Um, Pei Yi, as I know her, you know, since I joined, I was very impressed, impressed by her background because she was actually she worked, she was in a commercial、uh, real estate industry on Wall Street, but she guess what? She graduated from Wharton. Business school with an MBA degree, which is like you know, I I think、uh, I want all my children, you know, <laughs> look up to her like that, you know, um, and um, she um also you know she she hold like several different license, you know, in GIAs and real estate and and a lot of like certificate, you know, as we can see, like she's definitely very very strong, you know, academically, um, so. You know,、uh, despite her successful, you know, commercial real estate experience and career,、um, she joined our、uh, new skin business. Joined our team as a full time, and in short, in a very short period of time, Pei、uh, has reached the、uh, pinnacle of our compensation plan,、um, affording her uh, uh, the flexibility, you know,、uh, to pursue a privileged、uh, lifestyle. So let's welcome, you know,、uh, Pei Yi, and also、uh, Pei. She's very, I think she's very like、um, uh, analytical, and she loves she she questions everything pretty much. And I remember when I first joined, you know, given the background that I have, I wanted to you know learn more about the news before I go all in. So I did a lot of research. I read the financial, you know, the numbers.、Um, but I I I, I remember Pei Yi、uh, said like. I did all the research. You basically don't need to waste your time. <laughs> all the questions you have, I already asked. <laughs> so I was like, "Wow!" And then I did learn that from her a lot of you know、uh, uh, similar questions that you know she was able to、um, answer to provide the response like you know very、um, you know in detail. So anyway,、um, our topic today is actually looming inflation. Again, everyone, please have your pen and pencil or paper ready. You know, I'm. I'm guessing she's gonna have like tremendous like powerpoints and all you know numbers and data and it's gonna be very very um um、uh, insightful and also informational. So let's welcome、uh, Pei Yi Li. Okay, Pei, Yi, the floor is yours. Oh,、yours. thank you so much, Becca. Long time no see. <clears throat> um, I actually I just went back went to New York、uh, for the first time in quite a few months since I you know since the summer I haven't been back much and I just went to our、uh, brand new、uh, studio in、uh, Flushing. It's beautiful.、Um, really, I admire you know our teams you know especially Shirley, her business acumen, her dedication you know to the business to the team. 
And um, as Becca mentioned, I came from uh, investment banking background. So uh, digging into facts and research, all the, you know, getting to know the bottom of everything is almost like second nature to me. Um, I was first attracted to new skin because of product, because of the facial spa, because of age alchemy. And uh, as Becca mentioned, I always you know, nitpick everything. And I was uh, um, a model before when I was in college, when I got discovered by um, this like modeling agency. Um, so I was naturally, well, because of that, I was really attracted to skincare and makeup and stuff. So I, my dream to do an MBA was to go work for say L'Oreal or, as a louder, this type of business, so that um, I interviewed with them, I researched, you know, I visited their factory, and it was there that I realized, oh, you know, the ingredients are so cheap, you know, they use the cheapest, the lowest quality, um, well, bare minimum, you know, to, 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 how do I put it, to use marketing strategy to get the customer to spend money, and I, realized that the bottle actually worth more than the product inside. I was like, wow, this industry is evil then, you know, like I would not be, you know, going to work in this industry. And long story short, you know, after I graduated, you know, I somehow got into a finance school and then naturally we all ended up on Wall Street. And this time actually uh, looming inflation actually, I think is not looming anymore. It's actually very evident. And I was gonna say looming recession, but then, then I thought it's actually pressing, you know, because we are already in recession. So I think this whole, oh, I need the, uh, where's the, I need the right to share my PowerPoint. <laughs> so anyway, uh, I'll wait for yes. Sherry to come back. And um, so I'm sure 2022, this year has not been easy for anyone because we start off with skyrocketing, you know, this price of gas, right? I remember at the time when I saw um, just cars running on the highways, right? I just feel like the, the tailpipe of the every car, you know, I just see dollar bills coming up, right? So it's actually a pressing recession and what future holds for you, for us, for every one of us, right? So, and I'm sure, you know, this is the, the very first picture when I think when we re reminisce, you know, reminiscing um, the year of 2022 is the inflation at 40 year high. I remember seeing a picture on social media, a guy posted on Twitter. Um, so he shops at shops, right? And December 22nd, a dozen of eggs was $1.29. And in October 20th this year, it was $7.29. So it's insane. We're talking about daily lives. You know, if you look at this chart, it's a little uh, small, but Right on the top, 95.2% inflation is the food at work or at school, right? So because it's not just grocery store, but if you buy from work, from store, you have to, you know, from school, you have to, they have to add a markup. So I just don't know. I keep, I keep saying this. I was like, I don't know how people can survive because a lot of Americans have lived on, you know, not fixed income, but they have a fixed budget. Like there, for example, the, the real estate market cooled down significantly because interest rates rising, right? So there are many families they can only allocate this much to mortgage. So if the needle moves up just one bips, which is a one, uh, one percent of one percent, right? Like they, their mortgage gonna go up by like a hundred dollars or something, they cannot afford it. So that's how, you know, like linking to our business is how our business is so relevant is because we offer the flexibility, right? So inflation is all time high, like everything. I mean, for us as well, I'm sure all of us, we saw this year, you know, the company raised the price twice. It's never been done before, right? Unprecedented. And then also we limited the free shipping because of the gas price hike, right? So on top of that, starting in October, actually starting to start massive layoff, 11,000 people from Facebook got, got, laid, got laid off, right? And then Amazon, right? So this is like Amazon, another 10,000, right? So Bezos was on CNBC or CNN business, you know, talking about, oh, you know, if you have, 
So, you know, you guys can Google this, this, this video is on CNN business. So he was saying, oh, if you have a large purchase, you know, for the holidays, I would recommend you to maybe put off or hold on, you know, because you might not have a job by year end. As a matter of fact, I just had a customer. It was really funny because I was uh, promoting our Lumi Spa, especially the Rose Gold. And this customer has been wanting to buy it. But then the other day, the day of Lumi Spa launching, she texted me. She said, I just lost my job. So what I'm going to do, you know, it's like, oh, great. Come and join me in New Skin, right? <laughs> but that was kind of a little, it's a little abrupt, but, you know, I will let her. Um, how do I put it, you know, cool off a little bit and then talk to her about what her options are. So this is just tech companies, but if you look at, there's actually a website called layoff.com or layoff.fii.com, I think, you know, so you can go in and check all the companies. They have a table. You can, look, there's a 1,652 records and we're only at line 10. So if you scroll down this, this little scrolling bar, you can go to the very bottom as like there's just so many across different sectors. And you can see retail, consumer, transportation, finance, healthcare, real estate, food, education, crypto. Anybody still investing in crypto? <laughs> the hot, you know, the hot gig, you know, for the past how many years? Fitness, travel, construction on all others. And the green bar is 2022. So, you know, at this type of, you know, with this of a background, you know, and then this like we have tech layoffs in 2022. And then since COVID, right, since COVID is like employees laid off and the companies we laid off. So this whole like 2021 is the sort of a rosy period and nothing much is happening. And then bam, 2022 hits, right? So now as we heading into 2023, it's not going to get that much better. So it does have a news that's just everywhere. So our question for ourselves is that, how do we survive this, right? What the huge the future holds for us or for our you know prospects that we're trying to um, recruit into this business. So how do you thrive afterwards, right? So the first question we will ask is, so what are you looking for? Like we always want to gauge the desire or what they need, you know, where's the pain is for this person, you know, when we talk about this business, what, what, what are you looking for? If you were to make like say $500 extra a, a month or $1,000 extra a month, or as a replacement of your income, right? What are you looking for? What do you need this income for? So um, as we know, a lot of our um, distributors join the business because of flexibility. That's the number one, right? For me, it was the, you know, the flexibility and the freedom, the passive income that we could enjoy after we establish our, ourselves successfully. So um, we have no limits, right, on our, our income, because if you were working to with for any organization in corporate America, you're stuck where you're sort of slotted into these levels, you know, it goes with your seniority of your, you know, performance, you know, of your, you know, contribution to the team, da, 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 da. but there's always somebody above you, right? You can never surpass that person, but at New Skin, that's not, so, not the case, right? And then there's also, you know, we have the flexibility of traveling, you know, have fun while helping others, right? So helping others, this part is really, you know, um, it doesn't come, uh, very obvious at the beginning. However, you know, once you're, you know, in the business, once you get to know this business a little bit more, you realize, oh, I'm actually helping others realize their dreams that they would otherwise never could have possibly, you know, to achieve, you know, their goals. They probably never even thought about it, right? So that's the, the, the goal, like the purpose of our business. So nowadays, because of social media and because of COVID, everything is all of a sudden online right, because of technology, you know, Zoom, like we're using this app, it was not, you know, it did not exist before, right, and it became very, very popular during COVID, so the world has become very easily connectable, you know, we've never been so much connect and connected, and e-commerce is booming, and social commerce is actually going to surpass e-commerce, according to Forbes, so everyone 
wants to look beautiful and look and feel their very best. And at the past the past three years has certainly not contributing to that and add a lot of stress on people, if not physical illness, right? So there's a lot of opportunity here, right? So we're, and people nowadays, especially with the generation of Gen Z and then the millennials, you know, become the major working force in this world. They grew up with technology and the, the Forbes estimate, you know, Americans on average spend at least four hours on their phones every day on social media, right? So are they, is everybody making money from the time they spend on social media? No. Right, so, and then it's our job to help them to do that, right? Because people are looking for recommendations. They, I, I can't tell you how many posts on Facebook I saw a mom said, oh, I just saw this on Etsy, I love it. I just saw this on Pinterest, I love it. What do you think, right? So a lot of people are looking for inspirations, you know, on ideas, you know, on what to buy. When I, they went, oh, I, I saw that, I like it, so I'm gonna, by the same thing. So this is, has become a trend, right? And we, for any business or entrepreneurs, we need to know where the trend is leading us, right? So we need to know, you know, if we're spending so much time on social media, how can we benefit from it? You know, are we making money from our time spent on social media? So who are we as New Skin and what can we do? So we're New Skin, we're based in the US and we have, we're a business of 38 years of history and we're a publicly traded company on the New York Stock Exchange and we do business in nearly 50 countries. We are a multi-billion dollar company and our um, revenue, we're ranked uh, within the top 10. I think the latest was number seven in the global 100 direct selling companies. And uh, we've been publicly traded on New York Stock Exchange for 26 years. And we have been rated by the Forbes as one of the most trustworthy companies in the US. So we pride ourselves with um, being a scientific uh, science and innovation company. And we have hundreds of world-class scientists and then two world-class research centers. And we, partner, we have partnerships with top universities. In the 90s, we partnered with uh, Stanford University and the 180 series, that product was the result of that partnership. And we spent hundreds of millions of dollars in our research and development. And the most recent, I believe it was $30 million. And then we have been able to identify the sources of aging. We acquired the LifeGen Technologies company in 2011 and come with their the entire database. And that's when we started to use this age lock technology in both our supplements and our skincare lines. And we create products that actually work to deliver real results that's visible to naked eye. And we help people look young and feel the best. So we have been recognized as the world's number one at-home beauty device brand in the world for five years in a row by now. So for our facial spa, our body spa, and the latest is the Lumi spa, and also the Boost that's not available here yet, but it's available in Canada. So all these devices produce incredible results within minutes in the comfort of our own home. So that's the, the key that we want to make sure our products actually work. And that's really a lot of, we're not just one of the millions of gadgets that claim, you know, doing like all the stuff and nothing actually works. So that's what truly distinguishes uh, new skin. So this new uh, Lumispa IL, this is our second generation. Since the first generation launched, it already became the best selling cleansing device, uh, within the first 18 months, I recall 2 million units were sold. And this device can deliver seven skin benefits in two minute treatment, and then we can do that twice a day. And actually, if you do longer, it's actually fine as well. We have physicians came to present and then saying, does have a movement because it's so gentle and it's so effective, really. It's not because it does not hurt the skin, unlike the bristles type of uh, brushes. And Dr. Joe Chan also mentioned that as well in the introduction. So, I mean, I, I just have to say, you know, I don't know if people heard about um, Clarisonics, that brand. And if you Google it, you will see that it's, it went bankrupt. It got liquidated um, by L'Oreal because L'Oreal acquired it, but it went, you know, busted, you know, in 2021. 20, uh, 
um, because it's not selling. So I just have to say, you know, consumers know, you know, if this thing is hurting my skin or it's actually benefiting my skin, right? And then during that same time, Lumi Spa has been the best-selling cleansing device for four years in a row, you know, uh, according to your monitor international. So this is how, you know, because people love how their skin feels after just one use, two minutes, bam, they're glowing, you know, who doesn't want that? So now we also have, you know, these uh, visible results and, you know, like just they're visible to naked eye, right? And now we have this best-selling our um, Beauty Focus Collagen Plus. Once again, it's a product that gone, that's gone through many clinical trials. And then with clinically proven, I mean, I have to stress on this point because we are very uh, strict and conservative. You know, we always, I'm sure everybody receives the corporate, you know, like emails from time to time saying, oh, this is the guideline of things you can or cannot say, you know, during your promoting of this product. So we have to substantiate everything that we, we claim because we're a public company, right? So we impose on this like, 6S on all our products because that one of the S is substantiation. So everything we claim, we have to have scientific data to back it up. That's, you know, that's crucial. So during the four months double blinded clinical trial, we recognized that with the Lumi Spa, the benefits doubles when you combine the Lumi Spa and the Collagen Plus. So with the collagen alone is again clinically proven to increase collagen production by 65 percent and elastin by 18 percent and just in eight weeks but if you combine it the results doubles right so we've had we've received so many amazing before after pictures uh, to to show the testimonials right so which is really really amazing so um, in terms of when we come talk about business, because we're constantly innovating products, and also we have a, a, a very vast portfolio of products. So we have products for everyone, you know, at all different price points. To this day, we still have something that's like $10, $12, and $15. However, we would make the margin of the retail to make sure that new people can, when they join, they can make money immediately. So this is how I feel really appreciative of the company because we do not only in innovate on the product side, but also on the compensation policy side to make sure that distributors, when they join, they can make money immediately, really, because that's crucial to their retention rate, right? So we have something for everybody. You know, if you just want to make, you know, a couple hundred dollars extra a month, and there's a way of doing that, right? There are products point, price points just for those and then if you want to make a lot more money, the sky's the limit, you know, you can just take it and run, right? And then, or you want to establish a global distribution opportunity in 50 countries, you can do that too. So whether we're into also in terms of diversity, uh, diversified portfolio in terms of product types, we have beauty, health, nutrition, skincare, anti-aging, name it, you know, whichever area you're interested, you can focus on that too. You know, we have teams, uh, I recall there are a couple of uh, four-star, <laughs> Tim Ali, um, told me for three and a half years, they only sold toothpaste and they became four-star Tim Ali. And then we have a Malaysian team, they only sell TR90. They have no idea we have sunscreen, yet they're still, they're also doing amazing volume every month. So that's, you know, you don't have to do everything, right? There's something you're interested in, we have something for you. And using these products, we can show you how to build a global business, both off online and offline, because some teams, they do everything on Facebook. Some are only on so, uh, Instagram and another, some teams, you know, in Asia, especially they're still all about offline. They want to have that, you know, touch and feel of the products, you know, to that personal connection. And that's all, there are many, many ways of doing this business successfully. And it has been proven e either way, you know, whichever way you choose, there will be results. So what can we offer you? So we have social selling platform. We also have these, you know, nutrition uh, supplements. And we are a business that is free to sign up 
in contrast to a lot of other direct home selling companies who requires you to uh, purchase a some kind of you know um, consultation kit or you know entry level kit or you know introductory kit we don't have that it's completely free to sign up and there's no required purchase at all you can start working towards your goals right away you know and on your own schedule like i said there are many ways of doing this business it depends on how much you want to make right and that's your own goal and your there will be mentors and coaches will help you to set your goals and then guide you through along the way and then step by step teach you how to do you know what to do to so that you can achieve your goals so that's the, the key is to help people earn money right away by sharing new skin products empower others to do the same so here's an example um through social selling for example the how much the retail retail pro profit you can make as you promote and sell new skin products so many of our top selling products on social media have a very sweet price point of twenty to fifty dollars, and you can make around ten dollars in retail profit on each product you sell. For example, the toothpaste, right? We are. I think right now the member price is twelve and the retail price is twenty-two. Bam! There's your retail profit of ten dollars. So if you were to sell eight products over the week, uh, uh, per week over the course of a month, then you clear. $320. So for my, many people that could be, you know, that could cover a car payment, you know, groceries, you know, or it could be used at fund money. But when you start sharing higher price items, you have the potential to earn much more. So there's no limit on how much you can sell and earn. So here are some um, average incomes of our leaders. So through this scale, the very first leadership position at New Skin is brand representative right here. So at this level, you earn approximately $600 a month. And the numbers like, as you go up, you will have more, as you build your leadership team, you will have the potential to earn a lot more. These are all average figures. So if you were to help four people become a brand representative, that makes you a Ruby, and you could earn roughly about $3,200 a month. And there are no limit, again, in how far you can go. Really, the sky's the limit. I'm sure people see the chart of Shirley's that go from um, accumulate, accelerate, and explode, explode, right? So that's how typical a youth skin leader's trajectory is. So every six months, in addition to our compensation plan, we also have these rewards success trips, right? So in the past, here you would earn on um, a, you will qualify for a success trip. And these are the trips to five-star luxury vacation places, you know, to amazing destinations. So here we've been to um, South Africa, Ireland, South, Southern Caribbean cruise and Waikiki and Sydney, Australia, um, Punta Cana, Waikiki uh, again, and then uh, Mexico, Rivera, Maya. And Jamaica most recently, and next year we're going back to Punta Cana again. And uh, I think the Heart, Heart, uh, Heart Rock Cafe, uh, Heart, Heart Rock Hotel. So there's always, you know, we've seen so many um, team members bring their family, and that's how they recognize, oh, you know, New Skin is so different. And then we saw a lot of family members, uh, if they were not supporters, they would become supporters of this business after the success trip. So it's really uh, an amazing journey. So. Now, um, in terms of timing, so right now the global beauty device market is at roughly 50 billion size. The growth rate, this is the only rate I think beats the infl inflation rate, is growing at 20.6% a year. If you look at any investment in this environment, I don't think anything grows faster than this, right? So. If you this, but it's gonna reach three hundred eleven billion dollars this market by twenty thirty. So now the question for yourself is: Would you like to be part of this this growth, or you want to be a bystander, right, to just watch this train take off? So, in addition to um, the market size, and then look at this North America. We are the largest market bet region. 
and APAC would be the fastest growing market that region, right? So if we are Asian American, we're kind of, you know, touch upon both markets, which, you know, give us the unique advantage that we really should not waste, you know, and we always say do not waste a recession, a perfect recession is like a perfect storm. Do not waste it. So um, the, according to uh, USA Today, 74% millennials and 57% Gen X and 43% baby boomers are interested in freelancing. Right, I, I, I give um, a talk a long time ago, remember the, uh, the Forbes numbers that how back in uh, 2020, uh, almost like a third of US labor was doing some kind of a side gig. And then they were predicting by 2027, that number will go to half. Because of COVID, that number has already reached half. Right. So this is just shows you how many people, you know, because of uh, COVID, a lot of people don't want to go back to work anymore because they're used to, oh, you know, I can just work at home. And they're looking for alternatives to make money just from the comfort, you know, at home and from their phone. And then recession's coming, layoff is coming, you know, with all these tens of thousands of people get laid off, where do they go? Where do they go looking for options? So this is the perfect time for us to get a word out, to share the opportunity with people. Right, so um, so we're exploding in the U.S. And then back in uh, this year's uh, kickoff, I remember uh, Justin or um, Ryan was saying we are looking to grow like quadruple the size of our company in the next five years to become a ten billion dollar company. Right now, we're at two point five five billion in terms of revenue. So now the company, what I've seen over the past few years has been doing uh, diligently, you know, in terms of how to come up with uh, product bundles, you know, like design these bundles so that we could help and facilitate or accelerate the social selling practice, right? So everybody is on social media and social commerce will take over e-commerce eventually one day. So if we're not looking into that, you know, we should do that right away, right? So um, what else? So as we continue to innovate and to launch new products, you know, there has been a never really a better time to get started with all these social background, you know, this like backdrop that's what's happening right now in the economy, in the job market, in the inflation, you know, and the interest rate and everything, you know, it's like everybody would be looking for opportunity and we are here to Okay, so um, so what have a support and training we could provide? So we have, so the company has also in uh, renovate, well not renovate, but uh, revamped our website and also our apps. You know, I don't know if people notice the uh, Stella and Vera. So Vera is the app for consumers so that we can, especially for our new Lumi IO, you can connect with your phone and get instant feedback, whether you're doing your skin regimen correctly or you're missing some spots or you know, you're pressing too hard. So that kind of connectivity plus the tracking mechanism really has this you know, mechanism to not to, you know, um, how do I put it, to lock the customer in, but to attract the customer to check on their pro progress and also to facilitate them to use the product correctly so that they can get you know, the desired results, you know, so that they will have more confidence in the product so that they can purchase, we do, generally to repeat purchase, right? So this whole thing is really hand in hand. And then for the Stella side, you know, I know from the uh, corporate communication that they are uh, combining a few apps uh, targeting to the distributor all in one so that we can check our, you know, our volume, uh, how to track our customers and team members and, and among a bunch of other, oh, send out invitations, you know, do prospecting and follow up on customers all in one app, right? So this, I'm really eager to see, you know, all the improvements that they are impl implementing on the Stella app. And to, um, in terms, also another one is the My Site, which is something relatively new as well to um, help us to, uh, you know, set up a link to send people. So we don't have to do any of the website, you know, like, uh, 
you know, customer service, all that, it's all done already by New Skin. So all we have to focus is communicating to customers and then to follow up on them, to, to develop our team. And then that's all we need to do, right? So we are part of the OTG uh, organization. So we have um, uh, periodical training. We'll have the uh, Facebook uh, group. If you're not in, contact your upline or Blue Diamonds to get into that group. Every Saturday, we'll have mastermind training. And then every morning, we have the OTG morning call. And then we have um, uh, four times, uh, I want to say two, uh, the two times a year, I want to say, is the um, oops, January, we have the kickoff. And then April, Maybe not April, but July definitely will have a summit. I re recall in the usually in the past before COVID in April we also had a leadership summit in April. So we have all these kinds of events, corporate events that you know OTG organizes and we can go to. And then on top of that, hopefully after COVID, we're going to have the September annual meeting convention again, right? So in that case, you know we have four events per year, and we should be at every event and I'm sure you've heard the saying that the leaders are born at the events and I remember this a 20 million dollar uh, circle member um, excellence for circle member uh, a meetings leader I forgot his name he said I don't sell new skin I sell event tickets right so bringing new people to the events and then bring you know by showing up yourself as well to you know boost your energy boost your morale boost your team morale and then to get new people to get to know the company to see it you know firsthand you know oh wow look at our beautiful research center look at our beautiful headquarter right the space and then to interact with the company uh, senior uh, management those are all the experience really you know you can get you know um offline, no, no, online, right? Just through Zoom work, because it's not the same. So this is the type of uh, uh, support and training that we could offer. And then from the OTG level, and then on every team level, you know, we have our Monday training, and then we have every team, we have our own uh, training sessions as well. So there's a lot of, uh, you know, support provide to the new people so that, you know, they don't feel they're lost in a, you know, massive community. All right, so, um, I think that's all I have today. So the questions we ask is, you know, your big opportunity may be right here where you are now. You know, would you like to try the product? Would you like to try to share and sell the products to others? You know, do what we do. Or would you like to get started and business and lead your own team? All right, so that's all I have today. Thank you, everyone. Wow. <laughs> Thank you so much, Peggy, for the very insightful information and all the PowerPoint information. I mean, it's, what's stunning is that, you know, given all the inflation to all the layoffs from different tech, tech companies, the global beauty and device market is still goes up 20%, yes. 20.6%. I mean, we, I should say like, you know, we, 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 we're lucky, you know, we're in luck that, you know, North America, we, we're in the North America and then we have the APAC, you know, uh, market that we can focus yeah. in. I mean, these are the two huge markets that, you know, um, on the uh, uh, beauty, beauty, global beauty market. So, I mean, the, given New Skin's innovation, like everything that New Skin company can support us, you know, we, we are, we are the CEOs of our own business, right? It's your business, Absolutely. your way. We don't have to quit our job, current job and doing new skin. You can do it as you, you know, and you still own like a full-time job and then you do it at your side time, right? Given the social media uh, platform now, and we can just, you know, simply share and post our li lifestyles on Facebook and, every and then, you know, yeah. it's, it's just amazing that how we can do um, we can really leverage our time and then to really build our site business as plan B. Thank yes, you so I much. Always, oh, my yeah. pleasure. Yeah, I always say, you know, uh, I remember, you know, back in the 1931 in the Greatest Recession, I remember reading about it, Revlon um, uh, sales did really well. Why? Because lipstick is the cheapest way to pick me up. You know, so it's like, you know, it, it costs a few bucks or, you know, or a, um, 
uh, some kind of a cream or a skin or, or makeup item, right? Compared to say a expensive car or, you know, some kind of jewelry, skincare and makeup are actually really relatively um, inexpensive. So also I wanted to, you know, mentioned that you think about how many uh, women go to salons, you know, beauty parlors to get their massage, get their facial, they might not be able to afford it because, hey, you know, like their husband lost their job. Oops, you know, what are you going to do? So uh, to do this, if you average it out, you know, it's really a lot cheaper than going to the salons, right, to do it at home by yourself. So, you know, again, you know, don't waste a perfect recession because we are in one right now. Yeah. So. Wow. Okay, thank you very much for the sharing. Very, very, very well, nice. Always very a pleasure. Nice. Thank you for having me, um, Wanda Eugene. So, I, 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 I yeah. <laughs> anyone, on, on, I guess, anyone uh, online, do you have any questions for Pei? Any questions, guys? Shoot it out. She will have an answer for us. If not, <laughs> she will find out for us. <laughs> yes, it's called Google. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I just personally, I really, like, I think I'm, I've shared before how much I enjoy um, the freedom because I'm going to Taiwan in about two weeks. I'm just really wow. excited because I, I know I haven't been back since like, uh, since COVID. Yeah. So I wanted to ask, hey, Eugene, hey, where do you when go? You know, I know you guys are in your Taiwan apartment right now in Taipei, right? Wen's right beside me. She was just concerned about coming on screen here because we have an appointment coming up and she's ah. finished her beauty, um, her beauty program. <laughs> oh, oh come on. She can, she can join us. We always, you know, if I'm not presenting, I'll be, you know, you know, wearing a mask, you know, <laughs> for all our meetings. And, and that's another benefit of new skin meetings. You know, I don't, I don't, I can't remember how many Zooms were on during COVID. Everybody is having a mask on, you know, like, hey, you know, why not? It's doing the same time. Yeah. One yeah. stone, two verse. Yep. Yeah, you got to have fun, but thanks for being so thorough. I'm disappointed that we're going to be like ships passing in the night because we're in Taiwan now. We just got back from Thailand. We'll be leaving and you'll be coming. So at some I point, know. hopefully we can connect. I know. I, sure know. We'll I, I wish I could be in Taipei with you guys at the same time. That would be such a, you know, amazing experience. Uh, maybe yeah. maybe we'll uh, we'll have a reunion or something and we can uh, put something. Definitely. Definitely. Yeah. I, I just, I, I really love the, the freedom because I, you know, the summer I was in Europe for like uh, six weeks, you know, for a month and a half, you know, it's just like, I can't think of any job um, that I have done before could have given me this freedom. You know, it's, it's really, you know, you enjoy your kids when they're young and you take them on these trips and these are once in a lifetime, you know, I'm not going to go to Europe every year for, you know, six weeks. But, uh, you know, everything has a first time. So when I, I just, I just remember the moment I took her to Harry Potter, Warner Bros. Studio, which we went during the Team Elite trip in London. Oh, at that time, I, was, I have to take her here. So the moment she pushes the gate open, her light, her eyes lit up. Oh, those are, you know, priceless. Those are, those like the moment when your child was born, you know, you can never get it again. So that, those are the ones, you know, I captured on camera. Those are priceless, truly priceless. So I wish that for every one of you, you know, I'm sure you have your moments and, but this new skin really gives me that opportunity to, uh, to do that. Yeah. And well said. I mean, it is a tough journey. It's probably the toughest thing Wen and I have ever done. Uh, but we've been gone for a month now. We were at our home in Thailand. We we're at our home here in Taiwan. Um, yeah. We're back to New York now, at our home on Long Island. And um, our next trip will probably be um, to our home in Florida and then to um, a new home that we just purchased in Mexico. So, you know, for oh, somebody yes. that not come from money, um, I'm pinching myself. So like you said, you know, where can you not only generate this kind of income, but have the kind of flexibility, but the, the, the one real danger, uh, I don't even know if it's a danger, but you will become psychologically unemployable because I would never, ever, ever work for anybody else again, other than myself and my family. It just makes no yeah. sense. We've all been, or a lot of yeah. us have been in corporate America where you're earning significant money, but you know... There's somebody pulling that yeah. string and everything yeah. depends on that job. So if you're making some serious money, somebody owns you. That's just the bottom line. And I don't think that there's any price or any amount of income that's worth somebody owning me. 
I'm, I'm a free spirit and if we want to go, we go. And I know you, yeah. you know, so I, many of you guys I, have I, already gotten to that point. Joe's been traveling the world <laughs> with yeah, Dave. I so wasn't, it's worth, yeah, it's I worth the say, work. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I, I never thought I was a free spirit because I was always following this traditional path, you know, going to school, going to work, you know, and then just do what you have to do. And hopefully by 60 some years old, you're retired, but Hey, life changes, you know, the whole society changes, the world changes. Right. And then, so you, you know, if you're, you're, I was called, I guess you're a slave to somebody. And there's that, that you, you talk about that string. I, we, you know, in Chinese, we say there's a knife hanging on top of your head and that knife can fall on your head anytime. And that's not a good feeling. Yeah. So. We all know that. Well, thanks for your contribution. Shirley, thanks so much. We can't thank you for enough for your leadership. Um, I, I'd love to do a, a call with you and Dave, maybe over the next day or two, uh, just to discuss a few things. Um, but the future is bright. You know, as Peggy said, um, during the Great Depression, the one thing sales. And again, because in any economy, people want to feel good. And when they're tight for dough, they're going to look for inexpensive ways or less expensive ways to give them an emotional, you know, lift. Whether it's a haircut or a lipstick uh, or you know, Lumi IO. So um, let's get out there. Let's tell the story. Keep plugging. I know, you know, when you're in the middle of that journey, it's not so easy. You know, it's yeah. tough rejection. It's tough taking the nose. Um, but the, the more nose you get, it's a mathematical equation. It's an impossibility to continue getting nose without finding a yes. So um, each and every one of you are special. You have vision, you have talent, and that's the real challenge because you're looking for you and you're not that common. Uh, okay. Most people are going to die broke. They're not going to travel the world. They're going to do the nine to five or nine to nine or whatever they're doing and get to the point where they basically don't have any freedom or the kind of income that's going to outlast their life. And that's the number one fear outliving your money, right? Especially as we get older, because our income potential wanes. You've got to make it when you're young and when you have the vitality, when you have the strength, you have the vision, you have the discipline to do what we need to do. So stay the course. You know, when and I are right here and Shirley Payee, I mean, we've got so many people I can spend the next hour naming names. Um, we want you to be successful and, and, and we're rooting for you because we know you can do it only because if I did it, I know that anybody can do it, but it does take discipline, it does take vision, it does take hard work. So let's do it. Let's get out there and make it happen again. Um, Shirley, I don't know if you have any closing comments or any more questions for uh, Pei. Thank you, Pei, for your great sharing. And uh, Eugene, I really, we really want to go to Taiwan since Taiwan is already oh, open. Yeah, that's our ready. plan. That's oh. our plan for next year. Yeah, okay. that's our plan for next year, my team. And uh, yeah, this is an amazing business. I think this is the business for somebody to really know what they want for their life. And they're really looking for uh, everything independent, for example, like a time or financial. And especially uh, the most important is not just making money, is our time. Okay, we need to have time to stay with the people that we love. And we need to have this spend the time to know more about this war. And still, we need to have like a, uh, you know, uh, income and that can support us to make our dream come true. That's why financial vehicle is most important thing that you need to choose for your life. Uh, there's somebody, um, I feel like uh, the your financial vehicle design your lifestyle. I don't know if you believe that or not. Okay, that's why I see um, right now the economy is, is quite not that stable, but we are the one choosing, okay, run financial vehicle to, you know, support our family, to let us have a better lifestyle and a still to make money. I think a new skin allowed me in this eight years, okay, this eight years, and it give me a lot of, you know, um, like a personal growth and the leadership Okay, and also give me so much, you know, like amazing people like you guys, my mentor and my business partner, we be 
uh, you know, we build a business together. And I really want to build a business in Taiwan too. That's the one of my favorite country. How about you guys? You want to go together with me? Okay, we just need the one luggage and we can have our facial spa, our Lumi spa and iPad. My presentation, like what, you know, um, Pei show us, we just to wake people up, tell them they are possible to have a life like us. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Eugene. Thank you, everyone online. Yes, thank you to Pei. Thank you for your sharing and host, you know, Becca. Thank you. Thank See you, you next Monday. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good night, everyone. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, Happy Thanksgiving. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Bye. You. Bye. Good night. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thanks, everyone. Thanks. Bye.